Hey, this is a little video on the funny bone. I still often get asked, where in the body is the funny bone or what is the funny bone? Now, easy answer is, we actually don't have a separate bone that's the funny bone. It's kind of a play on words, I would say, maybe just to be actually funny when it is not when we uh, hit the funny bone, right? So this bone here, which is your upper arm bone, that's called the humerus. Now when you bang this end of the humerus, it's not really funny. Maybe someone's being cruel and calling it the funny bone end. So what we have here, can you see this blob of bone here at the bottom? That's called the medial epicondyle. Whatever blob of bone on the inside of your elbow. It has this little notch here, which you can probably see, which is a groove in which a nerve is held in. This nerve, so unfortunately, when you bend your elbow, is rather exposed and can't go anywhere. So it's stuck between well, whatever you hit, maybe a rock, and the hard place that is your elbow. So this nerve, the ulna nerve, runs through this little groove, is held in by the ligament so you don't lose it, and then goes all the way down with its little branches to the little finger. Now that's why when you bang the funny bone, you get this electric shock going all the way down your hand, you get the tingling, maybe even numbness in your little finger. It's the continuation of that nerve. One of the few larger nerves in the body that is so exposed and with that kind of um, sensitive, let's say, or easily uh, triggered. Yeah? You can feel it if you, if you take your finger here to that point of your elbow, yeah? well on the left side would be your same left arm, yeah? inside of the elbow here, you can feel when you, when you carefully probe in that groove towards the end of your elbow here, that there is that yeah, twang, 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 kind of little nerve bit in there. That's your funny bone, part of your humorous, nothing real to laugh about, but maybe you know a little bit more now. If you like these little videos, go and visit the website anatomyshow.com. I've got a lot more videos and information for you there. And I'll see you in the next one.